Hey folks, Christopher Bud here in a uh, beautiful, quiet Classic 6 in Murray Hill. So we're uh, a little bit below the uh, New York Public Library, the Grand Central Station, um, a tiny bit east of the Morgan Library, which if you don't know is the uh, home of the, um, the um, financier J.P. Morgan, and uh, is now a beautiful library with transcripts and all sorts of exhibits. Um, so this is a very quiet, uh, apartment on a quiet block, 36th Street, and uh, it's a classic six, so you get a lot of space. Uh, you can actually get a lot of light right now. The sun has not hit its uh, peak, but I did want to do the video before it got too bright because then it gets really contrasty, and I can handle that with photographs if you want to look at the photographs on the listing, but uh, with video it's a little more difficult, so I decided to do it uh, just before it gets too bright. But it is uh, a very bright apartment, even though uh, you enter from the lobby straight onto this floor. Uh, but when you look out, you're above the garden by about a floor. And um, it's, a, it's a very quiet area, like I said, in the back of the building. So let's take a look around. It's a, a musical apartment. Lots of famous pieces have been written here. And, um, there is a lovely grand piano, which uh, unfortunately doesn't come with the apartment, but it is uh, easy to have that kind of it's that kind of space that you can have a grand piano in. and um, beautiful living room, dining room, and these windows all face south except for that one there faces west. Um, there is actually light starting to hit the outside over there, so um, I need to make sure we don't get too bright. This window looks a little too bright. Let me see if I can uh, adjust my um, settings. That's the garden down there. And uh, back we go into the living room. We've got some uh, Closets here, or uh, they could be for China, or if it's a dining room, or if somebody decided to make this a bedroom, then you wouldn't have a separate dining room like we do now. And um, here are the lovely French doors. That's the entryway foyer. And we will head into the east wing which basically uh, consists of the large uh, main bedroom here. It has a, I believe, a queen-size bed and plenty of space, as you can see. There are all windows. That's a very large window facing south, a more standard window facing east, but uh, he has uh, some stained glass in that window. Uh, which can be opened. And then over here we have a, uh, a, a closet. Pretty deep. Can't really see in the video, but it's a deep closet. And uh, an ensuite bath. So that's the uh, ensuite bath. Also windowed with a shower. And then off we go to the kitchen, which is on this side of the apartment. Actually, there is a bathroom in between, which is sort of the main bathroom. Got a lovely cloth foot tub. Window facing east again. And a beautiful marble sink. Well, maybe not marble, but ceramic, very large, with the uh, vanity there. And then the next room is the kitchen, which is actually uh, in some apartments, or many apartments in this building. This was the bedroom, but um, it's in this apartment it is a kitchen. So it's a good, good sized kitchen, easy to cook in, lots of room to maneuver unlike some of the other apartments where you have the galley kitchen. Um, we also, and again this is a large window facing east in the kitchen. You got the kitchen sink, everything including the kitchen sink. 
And we also have um, a feature here that's a grandfathered washer dryer. That means um, other apartments may not be able to have washer dryers, but this one's been here for a long, long time, so um, you're allowed to have a washer dryer. A nice little wine collection here, and a uh, pantry. Now let's go to the other side of the apartment where we have two more bedrooms and a bathroom. So back through this hallway. There's an extra space here you could create in a closet. Um, but this is one bedroom it's being used as a studio right now. Lots of uh, musical equipment and a uh, pretty good sized window over there. And right next to it is another uh, bedroom. That is the uh, exit over there, the, the uh, service entrance. And here we have a closet. And this is a, a nice little room here. It could be child's bedroom, service uh, room. This is a very small bed, but it can be extended. And it has its own attached bath. For the shower again. So two bathrooms with showers, and one large bathroom with a tub. Two smaller bedrooms. One large bedroom, living room, dining room, which is a very extensive area, and a little entry foyer. So again, large classic six, Murray Hill, quiet on the um, on the floor as you enter the building, one flight above the garden which is beautifully decked out, if, again, if you look at the pictures. And um, we do get a lot of sunlight in this apartment a little bit later in the day. As you can see, it's starting to stream in now. And as the sun moves west, we get more and more light through all these windows until it hits the uh, westernmost window there. Christopher Butt with the Corcoran Group. If you're interested in this or any similar apartments, or any apartment at all in the country, call me at 917-721-0202. And my email address is cbutt at corcoran, C-O-R-C-O-R-A-N.com. For a lovely Classic Six in Murray Hill.